I'll show you how to crochet stockinette fabric with a crochet hook. First, please look at this. This is crocheted with a hook. If you pull the thread, Like this, it became a stockinette fabric. To explain the principle briefly, the head and leg of the single crochet are crocheted with another thread, and when the thread of the head is untied, the stockinette fabric remains. However, there is a special part in the way of inserting the crochet hook, so let's look at the details of crocheting while paying attention to that point. First, crochet chain stitches. Make a loop by crocheting slip stitch on the back ridge of the chain. By the way, this slip stitch is the first stitch of the stockinette. Next, crochet a chain stitch with another thread. From here, I will crochet single crochet stitches. And I will use different threads for the leg and head. The trick is to crochet loosely without pulling the thread too hard. You can change the thread every time, but if you put both of them on your finger, you can crochet faster. I crocheted a loop around. Do not crochet the slip stitch here. Continue to crochet it round and round. Also, from here, instead of putting the hook in the head of the single crochet, put the hook in the loop of the leg on the back side. Repeat this process from now on. If you pull the thread strongly, it will be difficult to insert the needle into the loop of the leg, so please be careful. At the end of the crocheting, rest the thread used to crochet the head. And crochet slip stitches with the thread I used to crochet legs. When you finish crocheting one round, pull the thread that was crocheting the head and untie it. Once untied, the stockinette fabric is ready. Interestingly, you can see the structural relationship between single crochet and stockinette, but it's not very practical. However, it may be useful if you want to knit something as thin as a finger of glove, or if you want to knit clothes for a small doll, for example. Thank you for viewing.